Hey everyone, it's Jonathan, and I am super excited to share something really special with you today. With so many AI tools out there right now, it's easy to get lost in the sea of options, right? From ChatGPT and Google Gemini to Claude and beyond, it feels like there's a new AI model dropping almost every week. Well, I'm here to help you cut through that noise. Over the next few weeks, I'm gonna dive deep into the world of AI chat platforms doing a full-on shootout between some of the most popular and powerful tools on the market. Here's what you can expect. I'll be reviewing 11 different AI software apps. We call these AI aggregation apps as they give you access to more than one model. And we're talking about some heavy hitters here. Tools like ChatHub, which brings together ChatGPT, Quad, and Gemini and Bing in one platform. Magi, which aims to revolutionize productivity and creativity for content creators. There's also Typing Mind with a multi-model support, Poe, U.com, Ruby.ai, and more. I'll be putting all of them to the test. You'll get the good, the bad, and the indifferent. I'm not holding back. I'll be comparing everything from user experience and features to pricing and overall value. Some might stand out as absolute game changers, while others, well, let's just say they might not be worth your time. Here's the lineup. We've got ChatHub, Magi, Typing Mind, Straco, Poe, U.com, Ruby.ai, OmniGPT, Servo, Optimize AI, and last but not least, AI for chat. Each platform claims to be the best at something, whether it's text generation, image creation, coding help, or managing your conversations but which ones truly live up to their promise. I'll also be declaring a winner at the end of the shootout, and don't worry, I'll break down everything so you can decide which platform is perfect for your needs. Whether you're a content creator, a developer, or just someone curious about AI, I've got you covered. If you're excited as I am to see which AI aggregator model comes out victorious, drop a comment below and let me know which tool you think will win. Do you have an early favorite? Or are there skeptical about all of them? Let's start the conversation below. So make sure you stay tuned, subscribe if you haven't already, and hit that notification bell so you won't miss the upcoming reviews. Trust me, you won't wanna miss out as I review which of these combination AI aggregator models are worth your time and which ones might leave you feeling indifferent. This is Jonathan and I'll catch you in the first review.